yes, this is going to be a hard hit for towns and cities. The New Hampshire Municipal Association says the towns and cities they're talking with are seeing big expenditures now and more in the future. 58% of those who had responded said they were already seeing revenue shortfalls, and that was just six weeks into the state of emergency. The COVID-19 pandemic is forcing some municipalities to spend more money on police, fire, and health departments, securing personal protective equipment, technology, and welfare services. Meanwhile, they're losing revenue in the areas of vehicle registrations, parking, and anticipating losses when it comes to property taxes. Manchester's mayor says the Mall of New Hampshire submitted a forbearance request for property taxes, and she expects more to follow. We probably will get some requests, and those are taken on a case-by-case -case basis. Manchester has already implemented a hiring freeze for non-essential employees, and this week Nashua is doing the same. If it's not essential, then we will defer the hire in an effort to save not only salary, but also benefit costs during this period of uncertainty. Municipalities will get some relief with the CARES Act, but some are hoping to get more in the future, wanting FEMA to reimburse 100 percent of the costs associated with overtime rather than the 75 percent, and they would like the next stimulus package to include direct money for cities and towns. And both mayors we spoke with said that before the pandemic hit, their, their economies were doing really well, so that helps them express optimism for the future while also acknowledging that people are hurting now. Reporting live, Jessica Marin, WMUR News 9.